Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well. Sorry it's been like two weeks since I've done a video. We were having some work on the house and we're still in the process of that so wasn't able to film because you would have hammering sounds in the back of the video and that's just a no. So um, today I'm just going to be doing a February empties videos because I know I'm a little late but I decided just why not do it now. I have them all in this um, basket because <laughs> I lost the bag but yeah I'm just go ahead and start it. There's Tresemme Mega Firm Hold Mega Firm Control Hairspray. I like using this for like the little poof on my hair and what I need is just like spray my hair down to hold it all day because it gets really windy. Right, like lately it's been really windy so um, yeah it's like a giant canister. I love these. These are always um, a repurchase for me. I always buy these. These are my, this is my go-to hairspray. It's like three, four dollars at like Target or Walmart. So yeah, there's that. The Dove Dry Shampoo. I love this stuff. It's like the, I've tried a lot of dry shampoos and I think this is like probably the best dry shampoo I have ever used. It gives me a little bit of volume. It makes my hair smell better. Um, Slops up all the oil. I like using it on like second day hair when I don't wash my hair the like, night, night before. And yeah, it's a really good shamp dry shampoo. It's just very nice. It smells, I don't think I get anything else out of here. I get like a little bit left, but that's that. The Clinique Toner number three. Um, this is the big one you get like when you buy the holiday packages. Um, this one actually broke, so I ended up buying a new one. But yeah, I used this entire thing up. This is a toner I use for my skin because I have oily skin, especially like right here. And it keeps me from breaking out, it holds my oil, it controls, you know, pH in my skin. It's something I have to have. Like, I can change my face wash and my moisturizer, but I have to have this. This is something I have to have, or my skin will be completely out of control. Sorry, there's a mosquito right there, and I keep looking at it. <laughs> and I want it to bite me. This is Min bleh, Mineral Fusion Volumizing Shampoo. I love this shampoo. I think it's the best shampoo I've ever used. It does give me a lot of volume. My hair has changed ever since I used this shampoo. This is probably my fourth bottle now. Um, it gives me a lot of volume. It's just a wonderful thing. It's like, it's like cruelty free, paraben free, gluten free. It's like, it's the ones you get at Whole Foods. You got these at the Whole Foods store or the health food stores and this has completely changed my hair. Like back in October, November, I got my hair done and I figured that I wanted to try something without salt and I found this and I've been using it ever since and I love this stuff. Um, so yeah, it's a really good shampoo. The Shea Moisture Olive and Green Tea Body Wash with Avocado. I share this in my January favorites. Yeah, my January favorites. And I absolutely love this stuff. I, I just, this makes my skin so moisturized and so, feels, my skin feels wonderful after using this. I can, I can even shave at this if I wanted to because it's so moisturizing. It's, I got it from Whole Foods and it's like, it's free of like parabens, fragrances, gluten, phthalates, sulfates, it's, and it's cruelty free and it's vegan. It's just a wonderful product. It smells really good. Like it, and it lathers up a lot. It lathers up probably better than like Bath and Body Works body washes, which I love those, but this lathers up so well and it's so moisturizing and I, I just love it. Pacifica Seafoam Complete Face Wash. I've been using this for, I think, I'm about three, two and a half, maybe three years now. It's my, like my, f probably like, I don't know, 10th bottle by now. <laughs> I got this like, I don't know, it lasts quite a long time. It lasts about like three, four months, five months at a time. And I've been using this, I found out about this on YouTube and I've just been using it. It removes makeup and it cleanses and tones at the same time. It doesn't break me out, doesn't cause any irritation in my skin, doesn't, you know, add any oil. It's just an all around good makeup remover and a face wash at the same time. And yeah, I get it at Target and it's really been hard to find this lately because I don't know why, I just cannot find it. It's only like one Target in my area that sells it. Moisturizing Shave Cream Sensitive, like, I can never say this right, it's a Sensitive Fragrance Free Shave Cream from Giovanni. Best shaving cream ever. I cannot use the Gillette or the Skin Intimate ones, they irritate my skin so much and I love this stuff. It's like a, um, I've raved about this so many times by now, I'm probably tired of it, but I get this at Whole Foods and it's like a cream, like a, like a cream base kind of thing and you just, you put it on your skin, you wait for a little bit and then you shave with it and it's just a wonderful, it does not leave any my skin's not dry, it's not like itchy or red, it, it shaves really well, it goes, the only problem with it, the only downside of it is that it clogs the razor really quickly, so you have to kind of rinse your razor more often, but other than that, it's a really good shaving cream. I love using this, and I just drop it, <laughs> but yeah, it's a good shaving cream. This is, <laughs> this is the Tom's Wicked Fresh Toothpaste. Let's just take a moment and talk about this toothpaste. This toothpaste is amazing. Like, I cannot use whitening toothpaste or any kind of, like, tartar control or, well, yeah, I can use tartar control, but I can't use like whitening toothpaste or any of those fancy Colgate or Crest ones because they just, 
make my teeth really sensitive. I don't know why, but they just always have. And I found this at Whole Foods. And it's like, it doesn't have like dyes or anything in it. And I figured, why not? And I've been using it and I really love this stuff. My teeth have not been irritated since then. Like my teeth are just wonderful. I can eat and drink without having like pain in my teeth anymore. And I've gone to the dentist and he says my dentist, my teeth are fine, but like, I don't know what it is. So I changed my toothpaste and I haven't had no problems. And this is wicked fresh and it lasts forever. This is the amazingest toothpaste ever. Got a deodorant here. Clinical strength, invisible, invisible solid, oh la la lavender. I don't know why I can never use the other deodorants out there. I I can't, I just use this and it is perfect for me. That's all I can say about that. That's the makeup removers. I got the simple cleansing facial wipes and then the simple eye makeup remover pads. I love these for removing my eye makeup. I just put on my eye, let it sit there for a couple seconds, massage it, and it removes everything, even my eyeliner, which is like everything proof. And it doesn't burn my eyes or anything, so that's a good thing. And these are really good for removing the majority of my makeup. I use this before I use my Clarisonic when I like wash my face at night. And this removes everything everything before I use a Clarisonic because if I don't, it'll get clogged up and the Clarisonic won't work really well. And then I'll just have all this messed up in my face and it's just now. So I use this to take out the majority of my makeup and then yeah, Clinique Pore Refining Solution Stay Matte Hydrator. I found out about this last year around maybe summertime when my skin was getting really, really oily again. Like it was starting to get really oilier than usual. So I started using this and this is really great. It doesn't break me out or add any oil. It really does control my oil throughout the day and it works well with my primers. So it holds oil all day. Like it works really nicely and it's the only thing that's downside you can't see where it's like at so you kind of have to just judge it by the weight that's the only thing i don't like about it it's a pump and it comes with a little thing but i lost it so this is a really good one a lip scrub the lush bubblegum lip scrub i love this stuff it's completely empty like i washed it out because i don't know why because i'm weird like that but it's a bubblegum lip scrub and i love this stuff i use it several times during the week and it helps my like my lips get like moisturized and not chapped and from getting all peely because if I don't like sometimes when you wear a lot of lipstick or you wear a lot of matte lipsticks your your lips become really really chapped or like kind of peely or kind of rough so I use this a couple times a week and it makes my lips so soft and moisturized afterwards I got a hand sanitizer a walk in the woods um smells really good I mean it smells it smells like man cologne that's all I could say about that I got a brow kind of thing here. It's the Milani Easy Brow. So hard for the camera to catch this one, but it has like a little spoolie on the top and it has a little twistable, which one doesn't won't twist up anymore, obviously, but I've been using this for, I think, a year or so, and I love this to do my eyebrows. It helps me shape them and then I fill them in with powder and then I'm good to go. Makeup Forever Smoky Lash was a sample in a little Sephora kind of thing. It's like a huge brush. I mean, I like it, but ugh. Um... I'm not going to purchase the real one. I actually, no, you know what? I might actually purchase the real one eventually, but I didn't really like it that much. It's not worth the hype for me, in my opinion. The Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I am definitely going to get the full size. I haven't gotten it around to getting it yet, but I am definitely going to get the full size. I love this mascara. This mascara has adds so much volume to my my mat, my um, lashes, and it it's so beautiful. It just makes them look so full and lush and voluminous and just pretty and kind of like, you know, out. This is the Milani Brow Shaping Clear Gel. Um, I've been using this for a couple months and I love this stuff. Um, it sets my eyebrows and it helps hold them all day. Hope you enjoyed my February Empties videos. Sorry I wasn't like fully in depth. I kind of just kind of threw it together and kind of just um, filmed it because <laughs> it's kind of late. It's like we're not even, we're almost halfway through March. No, not really. That's like the 10th. But yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Hopefully got some little mini reviews. A lot of these are repetitive because I use them so much so yeah, I just decided to just throw them up here to have an empties video because I like doing, I love doing empties videos. It's like my favorite thing to watch. So yeah, I just decided to do that and I hope you all enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.